There's probably a surprisingly easy answer to this. The body mass index system gets its fair share of criticism. If you know your height and weight, you can calculate your BMI using a chart like this. But BMI is monumentally shit at telling you anything more detailed. Two of you could have exactly the same BMI, but one of you could have more muscle tissue or different fat storage patterns, like having more visceral fat. BMI doesn't account for your actual body composition at all, which makes its transferability a bit hit and miss. For example, if black women have more muscle and mineral mass than white women, BMI would misclassify 12% of black women. Similar questions in Asian Indians, hence different races and ethnic ethnicities may be needing different BMI brackets, which could also vary by age, because being heavier may have a protective effect in the elderly. BMI also tells you sweet fuck all about your health on an individual level. You could have the same height and weight as someone else, but what if they smoke like a chimney, drink shitloads of alcohol, have a nutrient sparse diet, never exercise, and their favourite hobbies are combining recreational party drugs and licking dirty needles. BMI is so it cannot factor in any independent health risks. So, why is it used at all? Because unlike every body composition analysis device, it is simple, quick, cheap, and non-invasive. No fancy and expensive DEXA scans needed. No doctors pinching your abdomen with skin fold calipers. BMI allows you to identify crude trends across millions of people, like this. So you can say, oh shit, people who are underweight also seem to have a somewhat elevated mortality risk. I wonder why this is. In my opinion, the biggest problems with BMI aren't related to the system as such, but how that information is then used. If your weight creeps over that very binary threshold and you are suddenly labelled as overweight or obese, some doctors will immediately lecture you. They will tell you if you are healthy or not simply by looking at a chart, and not bothering to ask you any further questions or do any further medical tests. BMI has many limitations, but for collecting data and identifying crude trends, we don't actually have anything better. And in my opinion, it is fucking criminal that people use it to make snap judgments about your health on an individual level.